Hi, welcome. You're joining me for a gentle yoga class, level one. It's gonna be uh, for the whole body. And I hope you enjoy it with me. Let's take a few moments here, seated, centering, and establishing the breath for the practice. Close your eyes or lower your gaze. Relax. Keep a good posture in your upper body. Notice your breath. Don't change your breath just yet. Just being aware of the breath, of the movement of air in the nostrils. And now let's take three deep, slow breaths here. Now place your left hand on your heart and your right hand on top of the left. Just acknowledging your heart. Thanking your heart for working hard for you all the time. Now open your eyes, bring the hands to Anjali Mudra. All right. And uh, come down on your mat, on your belly, into the crocodile position. Lie down on your belly. Take your feet a little bit apart, step your forearms, bring your elbows into the chest just a little bit so the chest is slightly elevated, forehead down, and relax. Breathing here, noticing what happens in the back of the body as you stay in the crocodile pose. Notice where that breath goes as you take a deep inhalation. For the next five breaths, on the exhalation, you will engage your abdominals. So inhaling, everything relaxed. Exhaling, pull the belly towards the spine. And repeat a few more times.
exhale, squeeze. Inhale, release. One more breath like that. And then relax any effort to breathe. Bring your hands underneath the shoulders. Push yourself up. Take the knees apart to the sides of the mat, big toes together. Push back into child's pose. Continue with your deep breaths here. Now start shifting your hips side to side. And lift the head. Let's come down on the belly. Hands at the shoulder level. Take your hands uh, out to the sides of the mat, forehead down, feet together. If you're having a, any lower back issues, take your feet apart. Now, pressing the tops of the feet and the front of the pelvis into the mat, using your back muscles on the inhalation, gentle cobra, exhale, lower. Again, lengthen the spine. Again, squeeze the elbows. Exhale, lower. Good. Okay. Now, um, let's bring the hands underneath the shoulders. Okay. Now, Lift just the shoulders away from the mat. A few times. And now on the next inhalation, come up. Elbows bent, shoulders away from the ears. Exhale, lower. Inhale, come up. Exhale, lower. One more time. Coming up. Exhale, lower. And now tuck the toes. Come up onto um, hands and knees. Let's do a few cat-cow movements here. Inhaling, arching the back. Exhaling, rounding the back. find your neutral spine. Let's come down on the back. Knees bent. Ankles underneath the knees. Arms down alongside the body. We will start with a few rounds of dynamic bridge. On the inhalation, lift the pelvis, arms roll over the head. On the exhalation, lower everything down. Four more times. Inhale. 
Inhaling, coming up. Exhaling, lowering down. Two more times. Bring everything down, step the feet out wide, and windshield wiper the knees side to side. The abdominal squeeze. Place your hands on your lower belly just to uh, bring awareness to this area. Exhale completely. Inhale, and exhale, squeeze the belly, maybe roll the tailbone up a little bit, inhale, release, exhale, squeeze, 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 inhale, release, continue a few more times like that with the breath. Two more. And relax everything. Take a couple of deep breaths here. Now let's roll over to one side with the knees bent and then use your hands to push yourself up and taking our tabletop. Your hands are shoulder distance apart, wrists underneath the shoulders, knees and feet hip distance apart, abdominals in, spine is neutral. On the inhalation, extend the right leg back. And exhale, rounding the back, knee to nose. Inhale. Exhale. Again. One more time. And now re-extend the leg. And you can choose whether to keep your left hand down or maybe extending the left hand forward, the left arm, reaching back through your toes, reaching forward with the fingertips. Good, bring everything down and wag the tail, shift the hips side to side. The other side, so find your tabletop first, firm up the arms, and then on the inhalation, pull the abdominals in, so don't let this happen, okay? Spine neutral, extend the left leg back, and on the exhalation, knee to nose. Exhale. Inhale. Five. Four. Three. Two. And one. Re-extend the leg. 
tighten up the core and maybe you can choose to extend the right arm forward. And bring everything down and wag the tail. And from here, we're coming to standing. So be mindful and careful. Step one foot forward, then tuck the toes, lift the knee, and step the other foot forward, and then slowly come up. Mountain pose. Feet either hip distance apart or a little wider, if that's more comfortable for you. Strong body. Abdominals in, strong glutes, strong legs. Let's turn the palms to the front, shoulders down, chin neutral. Look into your inner world. Notice how your body is feeling. Try to get out of your head and into the body. And release, shake it off. Great. Now we're gonna need two blocks. If you don't have the blocks, uh, don't worry about it. You can do this without the blocks. So, but if you do have them, place one in between your thighs. <clears throat> and hold the other one in your hands like this. Now squeeze the block with your thighs. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, side bend to the left. Inhale, up. Exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, center. Exhale, side bend to the left. Inhale, center. Exhale, right. One more time to each side. Squeeze both blocks. Coming up. Now let's uh, set the block that uh, you were holding in your hands um, down, but do keep the block in between the sides. We're going to uh, practice chair pose. Inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, sit down into your chair. Bring the arms back. Reach the arms back. Squeeze the block. Inhale, come up. Repeat. Release the arms, set the block down. Now we'll do some, um, we'll continue with our chair, but uh, we'll add the breathing exercise. So now think about your exhalation as uh, cleansing and releasing the toxins, wastes. So make it your exhalation strong, exhaling the whatever negative stuff you want to get rid of. Inhale, reach the arms up and exhale sharply. Ha! Inhale. Ha! One more time. Inhale. Let it go. Ha! Let's take the uh, feet out wide with the toes pointing um, out. Okay. 
we're going to reach the arms up and then exhale sit down into your goddess pose cross the arms inhale come up again other elbow on top give yourself a hug inhale come up one more time reach up stretch look up maybe push your hips a little bit forward star pose and release bring it down okay. so let's bend the knees a little bit of a twist here in the goddess pose so bring your actually i'm going to use my block to support the hand so bring your um, block to your left foot rest your hand on the block and then extend the right arm up Coming up, inhale, and the other side. Good, let's come up. Now parallel your feet and bring the big toes a little bit toward each other inhale reach the chest up and exhale fold in between the feet to come up lift the head slide bend to the knees and bring yourself up all the way Bring your feet to hip distance apart. Inhale, reach the arms up. Big stretch, stretching through the sides of the rib cage. Exhale, left arm down, side bend to the left. Inhale, both arms up. Exhale, side bend to the right. Inhale, both arms reach up look up and exhale bring the arms down okay. and um, we're coming down to the mat taking child's pose use your breath to calm down the breath calm down the um, nervous system so take stay here in child's pose taking long slow deep breaths smoothing out the breath Now bring your hands underneath the shoulders, push yourself up, and let's lie down on the belly for another round of uh, back strengthening exercises. Extend your arms in front of you, palms facing each other, forehead down. On the inhalation, right arm and left leg come up, exhale lower. Inhale, left arm, right leg, exhale, lower. Again, alternating the sides with the breath. And one more time, left arm, right leg, and bring it all down. Step your forearms or hands, place the forehead down, take your feet apart, and take a few 
resting breath here. from here, roll over onto your back. I think I'm going to do a uh, supported bridge. So again, if you have your uh, block, bring your ankles underneath the knees for bridge. Lift the pelvis up and place the block underneath your sacrum at any height that works for you. You can bring the arms uh, above the head in the cactus position. And just let that block receive the weight of the body. If you don't have a block, you can use a book, or you can be in unsupported bridge. One more breath here. And then bring the arms down, press into your feet, lift up. Take the block out from underneath you and flatten your back on the mat. Let's bring the knees into the chest. You can gently rock side to side. You can make small circles with your knees to massage the lower back a little bit. One direction and then the other. Mm -hmm. Now, open your arms out at the shoulder level and then drop your knees to one side. You can place your hand on top of the knees and gently press down for a little bit deeper stretch here. Relax. And then bring the knees back up. Adjust uh, yourself on the mat. And then to the other side, drop the knees to the other side. Relax. Let's bring the knees back to center. Now extend your legs. Bring the arms over the head. Intertwine the fingers. Rotate the palms out. Take a deep breath in. And exhale. Hold the breath. And inhale. Tadaka Mudra with Kumhaka, breath retention. Again, inhale, hold the breath, and exhale. One more time. This time we'll be holding the um, out breath. Inhale, 
exhale, hold, and release. Release the arms. Now, if there's anything else your body needs, now is your time. I am gonna um, take happy baby, but if your body needs something else, uh, please feel free. You can just hug the knees into the chest. Let's take a few moments of rest. Take your Shavasana. Flat on your back with the feet apart, arms away from the body. Or you can bend the knees. Close your eyes and relax.
you'd like to stay in Shavasana, take longer relaxation, please feel free. If you're ready, bend your knees, roll over to one side, taking your time. Take a comfortable seating position, close your eyes, take a deep breath. And please join me in the peace invocation to seal the practice. We're going to chant OM one time on the exhalation and then say Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Peace, peace. Take a deep breath in. Oh. Shanti, Shanti, Shanti. Peace, peace, peace. Namaste. Thank you everyone for practicing um, and um, please leave a um, comment or a like and make yourself known. Uh, it's important and I will be very grateful if you do so and come back and join me next time. Thank you.